Welcome to another mega exciting five minute auto pairing. So Dark Passenger and I am two three six six. Let's try my pets or oh, okay, Greenfield theoretical for a moment. Delay the fight. Although knight e two now getting into this great pin with bishop g four. Whoops. <laughs> Uh, this is maybe the exchange sack line where I'm going to sack the exchange, hoping for some compensation. Uh, he's not going in for that at the moment. Maybe h3 here. Yeah. Is it too slow? Just to avoid the pin. Because a lot of black strategy is surely about d4 here. Yeah. Now knight c6, the exchange sack line is interesting. Um, can I play it? Or bishop e3? Can I just afford bishop e3 here? Let's try bishop e3. It's an unusual situation without this uh, pin. <clears throat> okay. Check. Yeah, we can get the queens off. Uh, then will I be crumbling? That's the thing. Well, King F1 is an alternative. Who says King F1? I don't like the look of Rook D8 there. Uh, I prefer King F1. But I'm not sure about this position either. Um, right, this bishop's going to be hanging. Uh, let's do something about that. There's queen b3 as an idea. On f7, he's left f7. That's one weakness of rook d8. Play for queen b3. Hmm. Yes. Um. Uh, apart from Queen B three, I can't really see that much. E five, Queen B three. Queen B three seems an idea. Taking on D four and E five, getting Queen B three. Um. Maybe take here with the Bishop. Uh you must be thinking about a sack on e5 or e5. So the f7 is the issue. Right, so bishop takes. Or knight takes. Knight takes. I'm going to be left with a pin, whatever. I'll take the knight for a moment. Bishop takes queen b3. So queen b3 here. Yeah. I get this Check. pawn. This position. Bishop d5 he takes. Bishop f4. That's d3. Uh, anything else? Nothing much going on there. And d3. It's dangerous. King g1, king h2, and d2, there's rook d1. I just want to get, okay. I think, oh, this is going to get dangerous with bishop a4. Huh. There's queen d3 to try and block bishop b5, bishop c4. I'm going to get king h2 and try and coordinate the pieces. d3 at the moment, I can take that, probably. Bishop e6. Can I? Mm. If I just play king h2 to connect the rooks here. There's bishop e5. Maybe bishop g3. There's queen d2. Right. f3, is that sufficient? For a moment, there's bishop e5. It's not looking good on the dark squares. Mm. 
I'm not sure what to do about that. Bishop e5. Will I just take it and g3? Will I risk that? Loose piece of that. Bishop d6, bishop e5. Bishop g3 may be safer for a moment. So just get out of the way. It forwards f4 actually. I think that might be just about okay. So I can get to play bishop e6. That's some tactic with bishop e5, f4 here. Hope not. Can I get to play bishop e6? Just to get a tempo. Will you listen to that? In the comments, listen. Um, so e5 takes away f6. Maybe that's interesting. I can back that up later. Oh, he's going for this pawn. Um, don't know what my bishop's really doing there. I, I don't know. Is d3, I mean, is d3 a threat? Can I do this? Maybe I want to exchange that here, I don't know. Queen c5, just hope for the best. Is this d pawn dangerous, or do I block it and then try and surround it? Basically. Uh, e5, f4, and try and surround the pawn. That's a plan. <coughs> Surroundable pawn or not? Is it a pass pawn? That's the question. This guy. If I play e5 now. Oh, he's on a2, man. I've just dropped a2. Alright, it's trade, trade, rook d4. It was his center pawn. Right, there's no tactic like e6. Queen c7. Uh, I'll keep an eye on. Yeah. What's happening here? We're trading. Right, so queen c6. Well, there's e6 coming up. There's an idea. E6 is an idea. Is that really possible? Rook eight, E6. No. Can I get behind this guy? Blockades, Rook E6, Queen C8. D3 does Rook D1. Okay, am I going to get E6 in? Um. Keep on these rooks. Like Queen A4, just keep an eye on the rook. Uh, I think he's just surrounding, he's winning my pawn. This is a problem. I'm going to get into pre move time soon at this rate. Now rook D2. No, that's not working yet. Um. I'll protect this guy. Then try and surround d2. Oh, he's, he's taking pawn. I've got e6 there. That'd be dangerous. e6, bishop h4, e6, e7. Unblockade. Give me give me e6, please. I think I want e6 anyway. 20 seconds. Queen e4. Okay, e6 here. So I'm protecting f4 for a moment from there. Rook d4, there's rook f4. Get to play e7 if rook d4. Again, rook d4, e7. And can I not just take that? Or e7. There's rook f8 on the cards here. I've got too much time. Rook d2, rook f8. I think is interesting as the concept. He's only got two seconds. I think rook f8. <laughs> Blimey. 
Okay, let's have a look. Yeah, it was a the opening's just wrong here. You don't play knight f3. The engine doesn't mind knight f3. Incredible. Is it an old line? Maybe it's an old line just disused. Um, bishop g4. Why is it this good for black? <laughs> Rook b1. Fascinating. It's not so easy, is it? Um, it takes her, takes her. Maybe, maybe it's not so terrible. Interesting. H3 is an idea. I don't know. Check. B5. I think this reminds me of a Fisher Spassky game with B5. That's a move here. Check. Uh, Queen D2 might have been playable. Takes. Check. Yeah, I thought rook d8 was scary. Here, for example, knight a5. What do I do there in this position? This? Does it just take? Check. This position? Is there compensation? Maybe there is on the c file. Hmm. Knight takes. Don't tell me this doesn't work. Why is it plus three? This looks like a nasty pin. Very nasty. This one hitting queen. So if rook takes, we just take here and we'll tear them up, right? If the queen goes there, knight f3. Okay, it was it was not great. Just bishop d2. I'm missing these tactics. Incredible. Bishop retreat. Incredible. He was spending Check. a lot of time there and it was just a blunder. He was spending a lot of time on a spectacular blunder to lose a piece. Uh, so yeah, black's better. Bishop e6 was okay for white now. Seems. Technically this is okay for white. I could have taken on a7 apparently. Taking on a7 again. I don't know, I've got prejudice to winning material out of here. Uh, I'm on d4. If ever he took here, Check. then there's queen d4 anyway. It's not that far away from the center as it might seem. So he suddenly protects a7. So I'm actually I'm actually okay here. Now why is taking Oh man, I'm just winning a bishop. <laughs> oh, this is embarrassing. This game, I'm just winning a bishop. Blimey! <laughs> I've made this a real struggle. This looks good anyway. Although, taking here now. Alright, it's only got seven seconds anyway. So I've, I've got this idea now of doing this. Uh, does this actually work? Yeah, Rook F8 actually Check. might actually work here. Check. 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 Right. Okay, Check. That, that's mating over there. Check. Check mate. So that that's that's bad news for black that position with rook f8. Okay, interesting stuff. Embarrassing these engines, I gotta say. Comments or questions on YouTube. Thanks very much.